Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying some Brewster's Real Ice Cream. I have the Black Raspberry Chocolate Chunk. I have banana. <laughs> These were $6.99 a pint, and we went to Nicholasville, Kentucky, in order to get these. And you, they have a, a list on the outside, and you can pick um, any ice cream that they have listed. You can pick that. Uh, they'll uh, put it in a cone or a bowl or a pint, or they have bigger containers yeah, that you can, you can choose from. You can get a scoop, anywhere from a scoop to like a whole gallon. Or yeah, like and that. we just picked uh, the, the pint because we thought that was a good size. I thought it was funny. Yours was this huge, long knot title, and I was just banana. Yours is just banana, <laughs> yeah. So, these, uh, last time we went, we, we, we've reviewed a lot from Brewster's, and these were just ones that we have not um, have not tried yet. Uh, so the black raspberry chocolate chip, it looks like there's tons of, or chocolate chunk. There's a lot of chunks in there. Um, it says, rich velvety black raspberry ice cream gets loaded up with chunks of premium chocolate for a little extra bite. Oh, and there's a lot of chocolate chunks in there. Mm -hmm. Try to get some of the raspberries by itself. Mm. That's a good idea. Mm. Wow. That tastes like a perfect piece of raspberry dark chocolate in a chocolate box. Mm -hmm. I was saying that too. It tastes like mm -hmm. the, the candies you get in a chocolate box. Mm -hmm. It's really good. That, that raspberry ice cream is excellent. That is perfection. I love that. Did you get a little bit of seed in the raspberry? Mm -hmm. I did too. So yeah, you, for sure I see. Yes, you would just want to know that. Mm. That's good. The raspberry and chocolate are really good together. Mm -hmm. And it would be the chocolate would almost overtake the raspberry except the raspberry is so strong, the flavors are, that it really goes, I mean it balances really nicely. I liked it when I took a bite of the raspberry just by itself. Yeah, you could just eat the raspberry by itself. You could. It's delicious. They probably do a version where they don't put any raspberry. chocolate in it. Yeah. However, the best part for me is those chocolate chunks. Mm -hmm. Yeah, like, it really adds a lot. It adds so much flavor and then once the raspberry has gone, and you've gotten a lot of that chocolate in your mouth, you get that chocolate all in your teeth and it it's melts. It's slowly melting. Oh, it melts so nicely and it is a darker chocolate, but it's not bitter at all. No, I mean, it might have slight bitterness to it, but it's not like bitter, bitter. I would give that a five out of five. It's excellent. I, it's, it's excellent, yes, yeah. I love yeah, that. I don't, I don't even love raspberry that much and no. I really like that. Yes. Um, okay, so now the, the banana, it says, with our banana ice cream, you'll get that delicious taste of the tropics without any banana peels to slip on. That's all it says. So it does, it's not telling you that it has slices or chunks or, you know. I know they didn't make it ridiculously golden, glow in the dark yellow. No, this looks like a real. Like the inside of a banana. Yeah, this looks like real banana. Not much to see, but. No. Is. Like this is the color of real banana. Mmm. I love it. That tastes like when we make homemade banana ice cream, that's what it tastes like, except it has a different texture. Mm -hmm. That's really dead on. Or banana, banana. homemade banana ice cream. And yep. it doesn't taste like an old brown banana? No. That is perfect. Tastes like a fresh banana. Mm-hmm. That is really good. I was afraid it was going to have that brown banana kind of flavor, but it no. really doesn't. Our, and it's not candy banana either. It's actual real banana. But yes, our, it amazes me <laughs> that our homemade banana ice cream, which I think we've done the recipe on YouTube, um, it, it's amazing to me that it tastes that much like mm -hmm. it. Now, I do think 
Um, homemade ice cream always has more of, I think, a grittiness to it. Texture. But I love the texture. And I'm sure of it's hundred percent on how how you make it. <laughs> I also think that our banana, every once in a while, you will get chunks of banana. Yeah, well, like I got a little pick. piece too. Okay, see, I did. Yeah, I've got just gotten one, the whole thing, but mm. or I thought I did. That could be my imagination. Yeah, I did not get any banana hunks at all, but. That's wonderful. Mm -hmm. It's very good. And there's no need to jazz it up. Like you could put whipped cream or crushed vanilla wafers. It doesn't need any of that. If you like a, a sweet, pure banana flavor, that is incredible. I, I think mm -hmm. they did a it's wonderful very, very, job with it. Yeah, they yeah. did a really, really good job. But both of these, very, very different uh, polar opposites. But I would give them both a five out of five. Yeah, I really I would do like them and would get them anytime. Yeah, that banana that would be really good in like a banana split. Oh, yes. Put that it would be better with the chocolate than, and yes. the vanilla. Yeah, I'd really rather have that than an actual banana because it's so sweet and creamy. Yeah. Um, but now, if you have a Brewster's, don't pass up on that uh, black raspberry and chocolate really chunk too because it is incredible too and the chocolate chunks are everything. Um, if you have a Brewster's in your area, and you haven't been, you should definitely go. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, and it's no, and you just got the, got the list, like you said, you pick out your flavors, tell them what you want. And they have like, don't they have like smoothies and stuff too? Have, We've just never yeah, had Yeah, milkshakes, they got, they yeah. pretty much anything you want. Yeah. Ice cream related, they've got it. Yes, but it's made there on site, and it's absolutely wonderful. And it's pretty cheap. Yes, six ninety nine for a, a, for a packed pint, yeah. That's made right there on site, yeah, uh -huh. you can't beat that. Yes. So I will have a picture for you at the end and thanks for watching.